one. Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I am showing you guys my diamond painting space, and I know that I already did um, an office tour, and if you haven't seen that video, you should check it out. Um, but I wanted to show this to you guys because it's going to be changing. My husband actually spoiled me rotten and bought me something else that I'm going to be using for diamond painting. But I wanted to show you guys this because this worked really well for me for the time being. It was not perfect. I did have issues with it, hence why I'm getting something new. But this did work in a pinch. I know some of you girls are just getting started, so I thought I would bring this to you and let you see it. This is just a table my husband made me. It's actually um, my school desk for my laptop and all of my crap that I do for school. Um, but I've actually since transitioned to something else. So I've been using this for my diamond painting. I'm not sure I may go back. We'll see. Um, he put a shelf on here for me that initially held my printer. But now it holds all my diamond painting supplies. As you guys saw in one of my videos, um, this houses all of my extra diamond painting supplies. If you haven't seen that video, go check it out. Um, this one houses all of my extra diamond paintings that I haven't started yet. Um, and I have reviews and stuff on a lot of those, so you can go check those out too. Down there we've got all of my extra pill bottles that I just keep stashed because those are where um, I put my extra diamonds when I'm all done with my diamond painting. I just stick them all in one bottle or one or two bottles together and that's how they go. Um, I love this table. Like I said, my husband made it for me. It's very sturdy. Very durable. It was very easy to make. We used it with spare wood we had around the house. So always an option for girls on a budget. Um, I will say that what I am currently getting also was not that expensive. So keep an eye out on Walmart.com and Amazon.com because there's lots of good finds on there for things. Um, so this is actually a painting easel. As you can see. Um, this is just an old painting easel that I had because I also do paintings. Um, if you guys are interested in seeing all of, any of those, let me know in the description or in the comments and I will show you guys some. Um, and then I just used this canvas that I had. It's just an extra canvas. And then all I did was took some clamps that were my husband's and I clamped my diamond painting to the canvas, as you can see. And I put the canvas on the easel just as if I was going to paint. And like I said, this does work. It works well. I have to hold it because it does slide around. But one solution for that would just be to put some of those grippy slide things on the bottom of this easel because it does have round feet. Um, and I think when I bought this easel, I paid around $10 for it. We were on a much tighter budget back then. So, um, so yeah, that's how I've been doing it. And then I also have my diamonds that I'm currently using house just because it worked in this cute little heart tin that belonged to my husband. Um, it's housing my wax and all of my current diamond paintings for this, or diamonds for this diamond painting. Um, so yeah, and that's just kind of my current space and this is what I've made work for me. So I wanted to film this now because I'm going to be doing an after um, when I get my new station that I'm going to be using. And um, I thought I would just put them together and give you a before and after video. So this is my diamond painting station right now, before. Um, and my new diamond painting station will be arriving in the next couple of days. And I will get that up and around and get that video recorded for you guys and get it out as soon as possible. So as always, I hope you enjoy this video. I hope you have a blessed day and happy planning. Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm really excited because I'm going to be showing you um, my the changes I've made to my diamond painting area. So, I in the beginning of this video, you guys saw what my diamond painting area looked like before. So, now I'm going to show you what it looks like after. And this is it. We have this great, big, beautiful drawing table. And this is out at Walmart.com. And this did sell as a drawing table. Um, I paid between $50 and $100 for this. Um, and I do believe it was on clearance. So it's typically a little bit more, but I got a good deal. Um, and my husband totally spoiled me, you guys. I saw it online, and he just said, buy it. And I couldn't believe it, but he did. So here we are. So, <laughs> laughing at me in the background. Um, so here we are. But anyway, so as 
you can see, it's got these wonderful trays in it that if you're not careful, you can totally push out of there, which I just totally did to screw up this video for like the third time. Okay, thank you, dear. All right, so as you can see, it has these beautiful trays. I've got some stuff stored in them. I've got my grippies, my clamps, all my clips, my diamond paintings just beautifully here in the center. And I actually tried it with the biggest diamond painting I have, and it, it's not quite big enough, but it's going to work. Um, and then over here we have the current diamonds I'm working with, my boat, my pens, all my things. Underneath we have all my extra diamond paintings, all my extra diamond painting storage, and my next set all kitted up, so I'm excited about that. It also comes with two little cloth drawers. The first one just is housing my current diamond painting uh, diamonds. The next one is just housing all of my extra stuff that I showed you guys was in that... Um, Oh, what do you call that thing? Uh, tackle box. Was in that tackle box? Well, I have since moved it from the tackle box into this drawer. And to be completely honest with you, it's probably going to move again because I have some more stuff coming from Amazon that um, is diamond painting supplies that I'm going to be doing a shopping haul on. And um, I'm going to have more stuff to figure out where to store. So that's why it's kind of all tossed in the drawer at the moment. Alright, and then the last thing I want to show you guys about this that I personally think is really cool is it's on wheels, first of all. Don't let me forget to mention that because that's one of the reasons I bought it. And they lock. And they lock, which is amazing. But the other really cool thing is this adjusts. Okay, so you can bring it way up like I have it, way up to here, or you can lay it. All the way down. Like oh. Lay a table. Or you can lay it all the way down. And what's really great about this is this also would work as a desk. Like for any of my ladies right now who have children home um, from school or they need a home desk themselves like this, this would work great. Um, because it is on wheels, you can move it around, it's got your storage in here, which is kind of what makes me think of kids because... It just would give your kids a place to put their pencils and their pens and their grippies and all their little things. Crayons. Crayons, whatever. Um, so, yeah, I really love this. And because it was so cheap, like, it would be the perfect solution for that living room, dining room space desk, I feel like, also. Um, but, yeah, now I do intend to use it as a drawing table because I needed a drawing table. Um, I haven't talked a lot about it on my channel, but along with diamond painting, I actually also paint with acrylic paint. Oh, that's all the way. Okay. I actually also paint with acrylic paint, and um, I think this will actually work really good, too, also for the drawings that I do for those. So that's going to be really nice. Um, so yeah, that is my new diamond painting space, and I am super excited. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you are interested in this table, this is not a promotion. I am not, none of my videos are sponsored. All of the products I review, I review myself. I pay for out of my own pocket or my husband's, depending on the day. Um, and that's just the way it is on this channel. So I don't have any more pockets. <laughs> Very funny, honey. <laughs> anyway, that's just the way it is on this channel. So you know you're getting honest reviews because I've paid out of pocket for these products myself. Um, but again, if anyone is interested in this desk, I can send you the link, or I will leave the link in the description, or in the comments section if you're interested. So let me know. And as always, I hope you have a blessed day, and happy crafting.